Tinimbu in shock. Atiku begs Spitobi. Hello everyone, welcome back once again. Atiku Abubakar, the presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, has just put up a bull by the horn. And so many obedience are not, are not comfortable with the, the plea he has pleaded to P2B. Ever since P2B lost in the presidential election, it, is, it was obvious that he won that election. But due to the, 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 the discriminating factors and other things attached to that election, they rigged it and, and, and all of that. And he voluntarily went to court to seek justice. And at the end of the day, the judiciary did their bid. Now, Atiku Abubakar who fail to form allegiance, who fail to understand that they have to form force to make sure that the ruling party of O Progressive Congress are knocked out of the political space, is now coming to plead to Peter Obi. Well, at the cost of this particular video, we're going to see the full plea and also what he has requested and the juicy promises he has made to Peter Obi. But before then, I would like you to stay put, watch this video and listen attentively to what this prominent man has to say over better a do one of Bola Metinimbu's minister who was caught right-handed committing fraud. Uh, President Tinimbu gave her the job because he's, he's, he, he, he made a, uh, a judgment call that she would fit into that ministry. Now I'm not I'm not going to judge ju ju uh, 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 pass judgment on her, but the the optics are really really disgusting that is just the bitter truth you know it seems some people are taking our president for granted and i think that is because they've only so far they've seen the dove side of uh of of, of bala the carrot side of bala now they are about to see the lion side you think the so? Stick side. Because the, I mean, I when I talk to some APC people, they mm. tell me that President Tinubu, the reason why a lot of your party members wanted him to get the, the APC ticket and win is because he's a chop I chop person. Ooh, Once my president, eats, no, no, you, not at all. Unlike Buari, that not, is being not, not, not what? being seen as someone who, who does they what? want others to actually. You know, well, and then we are least. talking of thirty nine billion year and and what did you see? Did were you able to account for anything from from that era? But do you know the number one uh, uh, anti-corruption fighter in this in the entire history of Nigeria is President Tinubu? Tell me. It how, is how, not to make Tinubu even starts it from an infrastructural, an architectural uh, uh, standpoint. He he first of all starts blocking leakages. People on on beyond to a lot of Nigerians, they don't even know what. Uh, our president has been doing well. That's why you're here. At yes, you blocking, very, you just, associate just blocking, government. blocking knowledge, the uh, 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 leakages in the government. You you know, strengthening institutions, strength, uh, uh, strengthening uh, 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 accountability. That, 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 that is what he did in Lagos. You know, this whole idea of oh, let me wait for somebody to thief uh, before I, I catch the president. That's not Balatinibo's. Uh, 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 preference. His, his first preference is I will prevent you from being able to steal in the first place. Then if as however you are able, you are you succeed in passing through a crack to steal, well, too bad for you because I will pounce on you. I believe we have heard this APC chieftain stating and defending Bola Metinibu's administration. Even when better he do is one of the persons that are culprit of corruption under the same government led by Bola Metinibu. That is to tell you that most times you don't need to trust politicians because for the fact that they have the covers of defending the associates they will do as stated that is just what really recently happened now look at exactly what atiku abubakar has called upon peter obi and other political party for them to form allegiance to dismantle and probably work on the next general election to make sure bola metinibu does not succeed in his next four years atiku Calls for allegiance between PDP and other political parties to wrestle power from APC in 2027. So many persons have started questioning this particular move by Atiku Abubakar. They are stating, why didn't he make this move earlier before the general election? That is to say, now that he has lost and there is no hope for him to get into the political space, he is now looking for a way to form allegiance. That is if he is going to still succeed. The, the opposition People's Democratic Party has said that without a genuine coalition, 
it will be difficult to take over power from the All Progressive Congress in the 2027 presidential election. The PDP's 2023 presidential candidate being Atikwa Baka, while hosting the National Executive Committee of Interparty Advisory Council of Nigeria, made a major proposal to establish a strong opposition party that would be able to dislodge APC in 2027. Atiku, who warned against the likelihood of Nigerians slipping into one party state, was quoted as saying, We have all seen how the APC is increasingly turning Nigeria into a dictatorship of one party. If we don't come together to challenge what the ruling party is trying to create, our democracy will suffer for it, and the consequences of it will affect the generation yet unborn. It is obvious that Atiku has made this plea to Peter Obi and other political parties, stating that they should come together to make sure that they dismantle Bola Ahmed Tinimbu's government. But the question that a lot of persons have started putting up to Atiku Abaka, why are you coming for allegiance? Why are you coming for major at this point in time? Because you know that you don't have any political reference and even relevance as, is, as we speak. The People's Democratic Party is not even an opposition party. They have never tackled any any policy that is not good for the masses that Bola Metinimbu has brought. And that has now raised a whole lot of reaction because Nigerians were so shocked, even Bola Metinimbu was, was so shocked to have seen this secret plan by Atiku Abaka to dismantle him. One of the reactions that spotted the timelight is this reaction from Dave. He stated, just arranging the tables so that he can be at the head of the table enough already nigeria is not an old boys club this is exactly what his message to atiku abubakar this other reaction from opera stated as long as he won't be at the ballot this reaction from princess stated nigerian shine your eyes they are all tinimbu and buharis because of the system they have built and maintained for years apc and pdplp has no ideology that would benefit you it is a clear statement this uh, reaction from tunde stated whether you guys form allegiance or not it is who becomes the flag bearer of the new party that matters if you put the same old faces to comma to comma become the party flag bearer it would be a disaster in waiting some one like me will prefer to just sit at home eat and sleep then to exercise than to exercise my franchise over nonsense there are numerous reaction re that has just mapped up over what article baka has pleaded to p2b react on the comment section what is your take should p2b adhere to article baka's plea or should he quash this uh, deceitful plea just for the selfish interest of Atikwa Abubakar. And don't forget to always hit the subscribe button so that you get notified when I drop more trending videos.